morning all today uh, we will be discussing about a ratio test ratio test let uk be the series with positive terms and suppose that limit k tending to infinity uk plus 1 by uk uk plus 1 by uk is equal to rho so uh, it's a ratio test is a test for convergence of a series testing for a convergence of a series so uk plus 1 by uk is equal to let uk plus 1 by uk is equal to rho if rho is less than 1 then the series is convergent if rho is greater than 1 or rho is equal to infinity the series is diverges if rho is equal to 1 the test fails or the set series may converge or diverge so that another test must be tried so this test will fail if rho is equal to 1 now let's move on to the problems first problem use the ratio test to determine whether the following series converge or diverge so the given series summation k equal to 1 to infinity 1 by k factory so here uk uk is equal to the series uk is equal to 1 by k factorial 1 by k factorial and uk plus 1 is equal to let uh, uk plus 1 put k is equal to k plus 1 here you get uk plus 1 is equal to 1 by k plus 1 factorial then uk plus 1 by uk limit uk plus 1 by uk is equal to rho which is equal to limit k tending to infinity k plus uh, k factorial divided by k factorial divided by k plus 1 factorial that is 1 by k factorial uk plus 1 1 by k plus 1 factorial divided by 1 by k factorial which is equal to k factorial divided by k plus 1 factorial and limit k tending to infinity k factorial divided by let's take k factorial as a uh, k plus 1 factorial is equal to k factorial into k plus 1 fact k plus 1 into k factorial which is equal to k plus 1 into k factorial k factorial k factorial cancelled limit k tending to infinity 1 by k plus 1 is equal to 0 which is less than 0 which is less than 0 uh, means uh, which is less than 1 which implies that the series is convergent the series is convergent so 1 by uh, k factorial summation 1 by k factorial the series is convergent then move on to the next problem test whether the series k by 2 raised to k is convergent or not now let uk is equal to k by 2 raised to k uk plus 1 is equal to k plus 1 divided by 2 raised to k rho is equal to limit k tending to infinity uk plus 1 by uk which is equal to limit k tending to infinity uk plus 1 is equal to k fact k plus 1 divided by 2 raised to k plus 1 into 2 raised to k divided by k which is equal to k plus 1 into 2 raised to k divided by 2 raised to k into 2 into k so 2 raised to k plus 1 uh, is equal to 2 raised to k into 2 so 2 raised to k 2 raised to k cancelled uh, the remaining is 1 by 2 into limit k tending to infinity 1 by 2 into k plus 1 divided by k now take k as a common factor 1 plus 1 by k divided by 2k limit k tending to infinity 
1 plus 1 by k divided by 2k into k. Now k, k get cancelled. Limit k tending to infinity 1 by 2 into 1 plus 1 by k which is equal to 1 by 2. So the limit value is equal to 1 by 2, which is uh, less than 1. Simple as that, the series is convergent. So the series summation k equal to 1 to infinity, k by 2 raised to k is convergent. Then move on to the next problem. Summation k is equal to 1 to infinity, k raised to k divided by k factorial. Now here, uk is equal to k raised to k by k factorial uk plus 1 is equal to k plus 1 the whole raised to k plus 1 divided by k plus 1 factorial now limit intending to or limit k tending to infinity uk plus 1 by uk is equal to limit k tending to infinity uk plus 1 that is k plus 1 raised to k plus 1 divided by k plus 1 factorial into 1 by uk that is uh, uk plus 1 divided by uk that is 1 by uk which is equal to k factorial divided by k raised to k now k plus 1 the whole raised to k into k plus 1 k plus 1 the whole raised to k plus 1 is equal to k plus 1 the whole raised to k into k plus 1 into k factorial divided by k plus 1 factorial can be written as k plus 1 into k factorial into k raised to k into k raised to k now limit k tending to infinity k plus 1 k plus 1 get cancelled k factorial k factorial get cancelled so the remaining is limit k tending to infinity k plus 1 the whole raised to k divided by k raised to k now take k as a k, k as a common factor which implies limit k tending to infinity k raised to k into 1 plus 1 by k k take as a common factor so 1 plus 1 by k so k raised to k into 1 plus 1 by k the whole raised to k divided by k raised to k now k raised to k k raised to k get cancelled limit k tending to infinity 1 by 1 plus k the whole raised to k limit k tending to infinity 1 plus 1 by k the whole raised to k is equal to e the exponential e raised to 1 e raised to 1 e raised to 1. So the value of e raised to 1, e is equal to 2.71821. So which is greater than 1, which is greater than 1, implies that the series is divergent. Now move on to the next problem. Test the convergence of test the convergence of the series whose nth term is n square by 2 raised to n. So given u raised to or u n is equal to nth term of the series is equal to n raised n square divided by 2 raised to n. So given series is summation n equal to 1 to infinity u n which is equal to summation n equal to 1 to infinity n square n square divided by 2 raised to 
Okay. Now u n is equal to n square by q raised to n. U n plus one is equal to n plus one whole square divided by q raised to n plus one. Now rho is equal to limit n tending to infinity u n plus 1 divided by u n which is equal to limit n tending to infinity n plus 1 whole square divided by 2 raised to n plus 1 into divided by u n which is equal to into 2 raised to n divided by n square which is equal to limit n tending to infinity uh, n plus 1 the whole square 2 raised to n so n plus 1 whole square uh, divided by into 2 raised to n divided by 2 raised to n plus 1 can be written as 2 raised to n into 2 into n square so n 2 raised to n 2 raised to n get cancelled which is equal to equal to limit n tending to infinity n plus 1 whole square divided by 2 into n square now take n as a common factor from the numerator which is equal to limit n tending to infinity n square into 1 plus 1 by n the whole square divided by 2 n square n square n square get cancelled now apply the limit which is equal to limit n tending to infinity 1 plus 1 by n whole square divided by 2 now apply the limit which is equal to limit n tends infinity 1 by n is equal to 0 so implies that limit 1 plus 1 by n the whole square limit is equal to 1 and limit n tends infinity 1 plus 1 by n whole square divided by 2 is equal to the limit is equal to 1 by 2 which is less than 1 so the sequence in the series is convergent the series is convergent series un summation un which is equal to summation n square divided by 2 raised to n n equal to 1 to infinity the series is convergent using ratio test now uh, another example Test the convergence of the series whose nth term is 2 raised to n divided by n cube. 2 raised to n divided by n cube. Now, u n is equal to 2 raised to n divided by n cube. u n plus 1 is equal to 2 raised to n plus 1 divided by n plus 1 the whole cube. Now, limit rho is equal to limit n tending to infinity u n plus 1 divided by u n which is equal to limit n tending to infinity 2 raised to n plus 1 divided by n plus 1 whole cube into divided by u n or which is equal to into 1 by u n which is equal to n cube divided by 2 raised to n equal to limit in tending to infinity 2 raised to n plus 1 is equal to 2 raised to n into 2 into n cube divided by n plus 
okay. into n plus 1 whole cube into 2 raised to n. 2 raised to n, 2 raised to n get cancelled, which is equal to limit intending to infinity. into two into n cube divided by n plus one all cube which is equal to limit n tending to infinity 2 into so take n cube as a common factor from the denominator so equal to n cube divided by n cube into 1 plus 1 by n whole cube n cube n cube get cancelled limit n tends to infinity 1 by 1 plus n the whole cube is equal to 1 Limit n tends to infinity 1 by n equal to 0. So limit n tending to infinity. Limit n tends to infinity 1 by 1 plus n is equal to 1. So the entire limit is equal to 2. Which is greater than 1 series is divergent series is divergent so says series summation 2 raised to n divided by n cube n equal to 1 to infinity diverges or the series is divergent using ratio test